What's up, you crazy people? Lord Peach is back with another butter build. Let's get right into it. All right, let's go to our trusty cart here, grab our stone, and let's get started. So today, I'm thinking of building a fort. It's going to be amazing. I've been always wanting to build a fort, so I'm just going to start laying this out like so. Essentially, we're going to make some squares to outline where we're going to build. And we're looking at this 5x5 uh, five five square. Um, so just as I'm doing one by one, we'll lay them down. That's uh, the square there that we're going to look for. So moving forward, we're just going to count out, uh, including the uh, sides seven blocks and we'll just go one by one here like so so we got three we got four we got five six seven eight nine and let's see okay there we go one more so there it is seven on each sides including the um first section there let's just round that out I think that's right. Let me, let me just make sure. Okay. And we'll just want to go ahead and mimic the same square on this side. And then we'll want to go ahead and do the same. Um, essentially making one big square with uh, four little... Um, what do you call them? Like the, the fort. Um, well, anyways. Let's just finish this out. And we'll move on to the next step. So with the outline now completed, we're going to move on and start placing bricks like so, essentially filling up the outline uh, with walls, just raising it up about 10 um, here just to get our fort going. So these, I, I feel like these are Minecraft basics, right? Minecraft's been around for so long now that uh, most everyone knows what this is about, right? We're just placing blocks and... Uh, I know a lot of folks tend to use uh, world edit, things like that, for the uh, monotonous tasks uh, of Minecraft. But, you know, sometimes you just gotta, you just gotta have some fun with the basics, right? Uh, so I'll just go ahead and, and, and get this all placed up. I'll speed this up again because really, um, I'm sure you'll have fun building this in your own world. You don't have to uh, watch me do it all. But, uh, hey, do let me know if you, uh, absolutely hate the sped up, um, you know, sped up videos, or if you care, don't care, um, what do you like to do? Do you use World Edit? You know, are you into modded? Did you know I have a modded series? Okay, I, I should stop <coughs> letting you know about that since there's only three episodes left, god damn. Anyways, let's, uh, not waste any more time and let's get this done. Okay. I know I lied. I just cut it, but here's what the end product needs to look like. Um, so I hope you uh, can follow right along. We're going to continue on and fill in the bridges here. We're just going to go up five. So the same thing, filling in the walls. But uh, just on the, on the point of, of speeding up the videos and such, you know, I prefer the transition, I think. Because really, I don't want to waste your, your time with the unnecessary minutes. I mean, if you really do love watching built step by step without, you know, any sped up, um, 
sections and just you know full on full on builds then uh let me know and i can i'll shift focus to the uh let's play that will have a lot more of those elements uh in it or you know i got one better just play the game and have fun right um that's what it's all about and uh so yeah i'm gonna just cut it again to the next part um, once you complete this we'll uh get into setting up some roofs and uh, it's it's gonna be awesome this uh this was actually a very fun build to uh to make for me and uh this is part one <clears throat> hopefully one day i get a better mic too um but yeah this is part one of many we'll uh be evolving this build it'll be a great kingdom that i build i hope and i'm back with the trusty minecart and chest combo we're gonna grab our spruce slab uh spruce wood or, or what do i want yeah let's just there we go um yeah we'll need it for later so anyways i'm gonna grab that and we'll get going on the walkway here so this is these are just the basics um here we're just gonna place one like that. Do I like that though? Mm, how about this? Yeah? I feel like I like the lighter better um, for the walkway. And then I tend to like to use the wooden pieces for supports. <laughs> this mic is gonna kill me. Uh, for support beams uh, later on. Uh, but let me know. Let me know. You know. Um, I've recently started this building game and, uh, definitely, uh, making gameful strides here. Boom, boom. Um, I also like to switch it up, you know, see, like, um, a lot of Let's Builders out there that I see make it very mechanical. Um, and I just like to switch it up and have fun. Trap chickens and shit. Um, next up using the stone bricks we just want to go ahead and outline the corners here and uh we we'll want to break them down and then just fill them up that way we're just adding a little depth here a little uh, more texture just so it uh gives our fort a little more character you know we don't want to be bland we don't want to be basic this fort ain't no basic bitch Next up, I'm going to need my half slab, stone brick, and some stairs. And we're just going to outline the edges like so. Basically, just going all the way around nicely, nice and easy. And on every other, we're just going to drop the half slab. And it's a nice little decoration. And we're just going to do the same on all the... Uh, outside parts of this fort i don't know what to call this thing. anyways it's just outlining it and again adding more decoration more detail just to give it a little character um you know roughing up the edges a bit just so it's not all just squares ain't no squares around here shit And now we'll want to do the same to the top, just going all the way around nicely. This uh, also gives us a little more protection. Um, be careful when you place them upside down, right? But um, it just gives us a little more protection from falling when we're uh, up there so high. And uh, I'm, 
I'm sure in the minds of our foes, there's an intimidation factor. Such a nice fort. Probably wouldn't want to attack it. Um, anyways, I'm, I'm a horrible maker of jokes. The joke maker! Joke's on you, watcher! Cause I can't make good jokes at all! Holy shit, yo! Anyways, uh, I'm just gonna finish this on all four, um, of these little fort thingies, um, watchtower thingies, and... Yeah, let's do it. All right, now we're left with my favorite part, busting out windows, or in, in this case. Here with the windows, you can basically go as, as freeform as you want, but I'm just checking out this wall, and uh, I'm thinking I want to stay proportionate, but I don't want to just have a big window in the middle um, all around, so here I'm just going to bust out two uh like i did and then uh this one in the middle i think uh yeah like that well, it looks pretty good um we'll just replicate that on this side as well so just going down three and then uh here going up two and i don't know what i want to do with the bridges yet so we'll leave those be but we'll just finish this up and then we'll uh add some some more things to our windows to make them look better than uh, just literal holes in the wall. Eh. This is uh, surprisingly not as boring as lifting up walls. But what are you going to do? Here we're a little off, so, you know, we'll just have a bottom window right at the floor level here because uh, we're so close. Yeah, see, that's not going to work. So, we'll want to fix this up, grab our stone later and fix it. But, uh, yeah, I think this might work. We'll just have a single. And then here, we'll go with the threes. And then, um, yeah, that should be fine. All right, let's grab the stone, make our little fixes here. I'm kind of a, a bit of a perfectionist. Um, when it comes to Minecraft. So like things like this, they tend to bother me at least in the early stages of building. Like once I get to like, uh, what do they call it? Maybe decorational or like just break shit and you're, or, I'm sorry, that's right. Give it texture, give it depth. Man, I love that. There's a dude I watched that, that says that. And, uh, it just, shit is funny, man. Um, but anyway, so yeah, I kind of like symmetry. So I slaved over this design um, for, for quite some time. And uh, I, I also kind of suck at roofs. And I hate a lot of uh, what I build for roofs. But here's uh, this kind of two-layered thingamajigger that I have. So here's kind of how we want to do it. We want to put down our little balcony like so and we want to just go with two walls uh 
there for support and then our planks go right there I think like that and then we go one one facing up uh, there we go okay and then on the other side the same like that see I'm, I'm yeah there we go one time less that's good I'm making progress um, so there we go one more on top on both sides and here we're just going to drop another plank and then a stair like that facing outwards. Next up we're going to take our planks and put them right there like so and then back to the stairs and then we'll just uh, sort of mimic but go one tier down so I have this layer effect sort of deal uh, a layered roof uh no not layered cake alex i like layered cake though um but yeah so they're kind of the same right it looks pretty good it's not too bad and then um we're gonna go ahead and just finish that up with uh the gate and some more stairs here like that, with the stairs, here we go, facing in, and right there, just got to do that from the inside though, yeah, right there, there we go, so place the trap door, and then uh, our gate, there we go. Close that off at the cap the stair and I'm just gonna finish up with my windows adding the wooden stairs uh, adding that shape you know that luster that flavor to your builds and we'll just uh, do that all the way around for all the outside windows for the rest of the forts uh, and sections is that what I want to call them? anyway so I've added a few doors and I'm gonna just keep adding those on and here we go we want to go ahead and not upside down but facing up three stairs so one two and three uh, not like that though there we go and on the other side we want to do the same thing so one not there two and no, I keep messing that up so bear with me uh, we'll just want to do upside down stairs there to round that out and then we go with our planks and then bam and wrong button bam like that we're gonna bust out the entryway at our cross beam and then we go in with the trap doors like this and on the top so these trap doors Not that, but they could be kind of like a protection point, right? You open the top one, shoot some arrows out or something if you're under siege or, um, you know, I don't know. I'm not really a tactical tactician, but uh, bear with me. So we're just going to cap that off there. And let's, uh, yeah, do it one more time, right? Um, yeah. Yeah, no, we want to do it facing out. It's better. Ah, it's always a struggle in this two by two world that is Minecraft. Here we go. Ah, oh, that was much smoother this time. Okay. And we got the cross beams. Let's see if we remember this right. It's one of the last doors. Um, Let's see, so stair, 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 and on this side the same. I'll figure this out, I swear.
and to just finish the roofs out I'm adding these upside down stairs as a finishing touch just a little more depth you know uh, I, I hope you guys don't get tired of me saying that um, but you know just to round it out um, is it necessary yeah probably not but you know is any of this necessary what you talking about Alex this shit is definitely necessary Lord Petrie demands it sorry anyways uh I'm going to finish this up and move on to uh, the interior and building out the two towers. Uh, sorry, four towers. The four towers that we have built. Doesn't this look nice though? So these towers are really kind of easy. After you section them out, it's just a matter of setting up the beams going all the way to the top. And with that done, this is kind of uh, simple too. We're just gonna go ahead and go across with our cross beams. And uh, there we go. One, two, a couple more. There's really nothing to it. I think the most exciting thing about this is my heavy breathing on this silly ass mic. Um. But yeah, there we go. Um, bam and bam. So now we're going to build a little bit of a staircase going up to the second floor. Uh, with this tower, the reason I'm doing that, actually it's shorter. Uh, if you look, and that's just geography. So you could do it to all the towers if you really wanted. Um, but the, uh, the other towers, I'm leveraging stairs. For this one, I'm uh, just gonna make this staircase. And actually, we're gonna need to take out the uh, wood there, excuse me. Don't like burping. Man, this food I ate today. Mm. And actually, I'm gonna go ahead and, uh, as much as I hate to break up my support beams, I'm gonna just go ahead and add that in with the slabs, bust that up a bit. And uh, so now it's kind of a hybrid, right? You got some wood and some slabs, but we'll just go all the way around um, just so it looks a little more consistent. Yeah, that's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. Let's finish that up one, two, bam, bam. All right, to finish this out, we'll just wanna that out so I can walk around but um, yeah we'll just want to add some cross beams uh, if you haven't realized by now that I love cross beams well I definitely love cross beams uh, so we're just gonna go ahead all the way around and uh, we'll add some stairs here for support uh, aesthetics aesthetics are everything texturing layering adding depth world of cubes depth is everything I don't I don't know I don't like the, uh, the stairs all around in uh, close quarters it just doesn't it doesn't tickle my fancy but hey if it's something that you like by all means go ahead so let's just finish this up like this one two three one two three all around the uh, I'm trying to figure out what rhymes with three. Okay. All right, let's just finish this up. We're going to go ahead and bust in some stairs right here in this corner. That way we have a way of getting up to the roof, actually. Nothing fancy. Just one, two, and bam. Like that, we'll add one just so it's easier. Put a trap door down. Yep, that's nice. And then just brick it up. Brick it up. One, two, three, four, five. And here we go. So we got to actually add a door. And that's really just going to be a simple simple walkway 
like this. We're gonna go out uh, about seven, Let's see, four, five. Bam, 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 bam. Six, six. And then here, we're gonna go up three. I'm using half slabs, so it looks like I'm dropping more than I am. But if you go up three, there, that should be more than plenty. And then down here, we'll just go one, one, two, one, one, two, and one. And then the same thing on the other side. So let's see, we go ones and then, yeah, twos and twos. Uh, nothing fancy, but still just enough, enough depth. And then we'll just mirror that just for a little bit of a pizzazz. <laughs> The roof here is nothing too extravagant. Um, just again that step um, with the upside down stair uh, scenario like this. And we'll just go all the way to the edge like so. And then do the same thing right there. So here we go. And we'll fix that in a sec. But uh, yeah, basically just want to drop the roof down. And... And there's our layered effect. Just gonna fix the uh, that brick right there and add my upside down stair. And yeah, it's a nice little roof. And my favorite part coming up here, just hoeing the dirt a little bit, putting the seed down, planting it deep so we have some plentiful harvest for our little fort slash barracks slash entryway into a castle may well okay so I may have just given you a secret but um thanks for uh tuning in for part one uh, i'm not sure how many parts this build will have to be honest with you it's very extendable if, you, if i may say so myself and uh, i'll be extending it you know maybe adding some castle walls adding uh proper barracks I don't know. I mean, the opportunities really are endless with this one. Uh, anything castle related, you can expand it as, as as much as you want, right? We'll maybe build a little village nearby so that you know we can collect collect beefdoms, um, you know, or whatever. And uh, anyways, I've blabbered on too much. If you enjoyed the episode so far, uh, give us a thumbs up. Always appreciate those comments. Are amazing. And if you really want to suffer through some more of this kind of bullshit, hit that subscribe button. And let's queue up the tour. Mm -hmm.